Hi guys. IL3D here. Hope you've been fine. Some of you has been asking about how to reach this kind of skin shader in Blender. First of all, it's not the cheapest one in terms of memory, maybe your viewport could turns a bit laggy, most of all of the ambient occlusion node, but this is worth it in the end. So, there you go. First you must have the node wrangler add-in activated to see what's happening with the nodes in the viewport. Then, create a new mat, add an AO and A layer weight nodes. We going to mix this two nodes with two different mix RGB nodes. In the middle of each mix RGB add a color ramp. Connect the layer weight facing output to the color ramp and use the color ramp as factor of the mix RGB. Then connect the second mix RGB in the second color slot of the first mixer node. Then connect the color ramp as factor and connect the AO output of the ambient occlusion node to the second color ramp. This is the basic setup, easy as breath. Here comes the fun part. Let's tweak the facing blend amount to 0.770. Then crank the color ramp and invert the black and white position until you see a nice white gray and black gradient in the model. Now let's set the color who will work as soft shadow of the skin by selecting first slot of the first mix RGB. Good. Now let's work in the AO who will work as main shadow color. Again let's crank the color ramp, but this time let black and white bucket in their default order. Adjust the position of the black one a bit, just to get a nice contrast in the places where light is not that strong. And then adjust the samples to the maximum or 128. The black bucket will be represented as the first color of the mix RBG. And the base skin tone will be the second color. Use the colors you need. Almost done. Let's set a subsurface value to 0.5 and change the subsurface color. Cool. Now the final Twix. And there you have it. If you want to learn something about my workflow or just like to see this kind of content, don't forget go to my Facebook page and give it a like. I really appreciate it. Leave your comments I'll be responding to all of them. So, be nice, be good. See you around, bye.